Now we're doing social bookmarking. Before we do that, we need to create a new URL list. Actually, you could use the same URL list, but for this video, I'm just going to go ahead and create a new one. First, I'm going to rename it and I'm going to say online dating social bookmarking. It's just easier to track your links if you have a list for everything you do. However, it is okay and it is possible to use the same list for everything you do. If you don't really care about tidying up your links and keeping track of them, then you might as well use just one list for everything you do. Before you can go ahead and make social bookmarking submissions, you need to have an account for those websites. In order to create an account, you need to go to New and Account Creation and then make sure you create accounts for social bookmarking submissions. Now, I've already done that inside test project number one. I have accounts for the websites that I'm going to submit to right now. I'm good to go, but you want to make sure you do that before your submissions. Once that's done, let's go to New, Submissions, and then select Social Bookmark. Now, we want to rename this. Let's say Dating Online again. Let's open it up by double clicking. It selected the accounts that I have registered with. As you can see, most of them I have already registered on. Now, there are a couple here with high PR. When I did this, I actually sorted the websites by PR, and then I selected those with the high PR and registered onto them. I have already these sites selected automatically because I have accounts for them. Now, I need to go here to submit information. Again, before I do that, I want to make sure the project profile is correct. You want to make sure your accounts are under profile number one and project URL. You want to go with online dating social bookmarking this time. Let's go and submit information. Again, the article is spinnable. We can do the same, let's say three tips or three techniques for attracting women online. And then the keywords. The keywords are comma separated. We can say attract women online, meet women online, or date women or girls online. Again, this is spinnable as well. Now, we have the body. When it comes to the body, it's a little different for social bookmarking submissions because the body should not be too long. It should actually be just one paragraph. I'm going to go ahead and copy the one from my article and just paste it in here. This is my paragraph. Make sure for social bookmarking that these are not too long because if they are, then you might not get a high success rate because some social bookmarking sites are going to refuse you. Some are going to shorten this automatically, even if you have something longer. But just to be safe, go ahead and use just one paragraph because that's when you're going to get the best success rate. Basically, it's almost the same as social network submission, which we looked at in the previous video, but over here, this is shorter. Also, when it comes to URL, it's a little bit different. The Submit Information tab over here, you want to place the URL differently. We would say google.com. Previously, we placed the URL as an HTML tag inside the text. But right now, we want to put the URL over here. We can again hit the preview button to see how this looks. The URL is not visible anywhere because it's not going to be visible inside the article. But it will be sent to the social bookmarking sites so they will know what your URL is. That's how you're going to get your backlinks. All right. Once that's done, we can go ahead instantly. Start the submission. Then go back here and start the submission and we're going to see total success and total fail rate. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and close this video because as soon as the submission is done, you just need to click finish and that's pretty much all you need to do. You've already seen how the submissions work, so there's no reason for you to wait another minute until this is done. All right, I'll see you in the next video in which we'll talk about PDF sharing site submissions.